Hi, this is Karthik Sood and there are two ways to crowdfund successfully. We have with us Vilak co-founder and CEO Mayuk Chaudhary to tell you the same. It's okay to ask for help and in the digital medium it's important that the help is being asked from a wider source of people or a social network. So the first rule is that whenever there is a medical emergency, it's important that multiple people are involved in a fundraiser because the family by themselves are busy in dealing with the hospital and the emergency itself. So one of the first thumb rules is to create a WhatsApp group of people who may be willing and a close friends, family who are willing to run a fundraiser together. The second one is essentially to build credibility on a social network, be it Facebook or WhatsApp. And nothing builds credibility better than the first set of circles, my close friends or family sharing it on their own you know, groups as well as uh, posts. The next piece uh, and a very powerful social network that all of us have and we kind of tend to ignore it at times is the office network and our colleagues. And therefore internal messengers, office emails, they should become an important part of the fundraising effort. And the final group are essentially common interest groups. You know, people who have faced a similar condition before, who are interested in the cause or you know, the piece on which somebody is fundraising. And I believe in terms of social networks, Instagram and Twitter are a couple of platforms which are extremely powerful for that common interest group. Thank you.